foreign students who come from cultures and countries where anti-Semitism is how they think about the world, right? So these are not your ordinary student groups like the young uh, college Republicans or the young Democrats. These are students who come with a serious agenda who are have ties to terrorist organizations. My name is Rebecca. I'm a UC Santa Cruz film and digital media student. I'm a member of the UCSC Committee for Justice in Palestine and several other campus organizations. As a former student of Tammy's, I have to say that watching that video was like a slap in the face. It's incredible to spend a year, over a year, developing a relationship with an instructor only to have them turn around and smear you in such an ugly and, and unfortunately ignorant way. As a Jewish student, I think it's really important to say that her comments do not represent me or my community. Um, they actually don't protect us, they bring shame to us. I sincerely hope that more of us will speak out about this and say that um, these comments do not represent us and they're not okay. The only thing that is worse than the, the comments that Tammy made is the school's inability to respond to them. I think that um, you know there's been a very long and well-documented pattern of intimidation and silencing of Muslim and pro-Palestinian students on our campuses. I myself have gotten hate mail with very similar accusations to the ones that Tammy makes. People said things like, oh, you're connected to the Muslim Brotherhood or somehow receiving funding from the Saudis, which is just completely ridiculous. I've also been threatened personally and physically um, and have very misogynistic comments made at the same time. Beyond that, I think that um, the university has created an, an atmosphere in which comments like these are acceptable because so much of the rhetoric around campus climate that has been coming from the school seems to just already assume that Muslim and pro-Palestinian students are supportive of terrorism or are anti-Semitic. This is definitely contributing to the problem. All you have to do is look at how similar incidents have been responded to on other campuses to see that like the, the way that UC is handling this is not okay and it's actually an embarrassment to our like institution. This issue is not going away. We students are not going away. No comment is not enough and we need our school to act.